Uh, I have got something else to show you. Uh, I've f found out how to change skins. And I've got Link initially. Then I had Samus. And I asked someone to make me Tails from... Oh, crap. Wow, that guy hits hard. I asked someone to make me Tails from Sonic the Hedgehog. Shit, that just wipes out everything. You are a big, bad motherfucker, and I don't like you. Go away. Shit. Wait. Note to self, do not fight golems. What is... Oh, that's a hell demon again. No, I'm not going through that. Everything is so powerful here. I don't know if it's because I've come in at level 41 or whether these places are just genuinely difficult. The XP reward isn't even that great. Now these uh, these thorn trees don't seem to drop anything. These fire scrubs, however, uh, drop plant fibers, which we used for. Hold on, that didn't drop plant fibers. That dropped logs. Oh right, they drop different things depending on what they are. Oh no, logs and plant fibers are off the same thing. Oh, it's cotton that's different. Okay, so there's a wizard dude, but uh, we're not too interested in him at the moment. The mountain ranges through here are pretty steep. They do give you a great view of everything around. Oh, there's another hell demon. There's so many. It's not, I mean, like, ogres are not rare, but there's not millions of them. Let's do the hang glider. But here, everything is just massive or really powerful. Imps, devourers, demons, minotaurs. I'm not sure I like this biome too much. I'd quite like to see a boss, though. A boss would be interesting. And we'll go into a dungeon, because obviously dungeon you get the uh, the custom mobs as well. There are quite a few friendly dudes here, which is quite good. But with the custom mobs, they, I, I don't even know. I don't even know what it's going to be. Let's take a look at this iron. Okay, so we should be nearly there. I'm just going to do a bit of hang gliding and get over there. Certainly don't want to be aggroing anything here. Oh god, what's that? Oh, screw you, it's hard enough here, guys. No, you two douche fuckers. Ooh, ding, ding. Sod off. The fire and the water mage there. That is not a good combination, usually. Oh, phew. What the hell, guys? This is a difficult place, let alone without you messing things up. Right, where's Clive gone? There he is. Let's go. Okay, so I've got uh, I've got to level 42 now, which is good. You would have noticed that there's been quite a big break because travelling across eight biomes does mean a lot of mobs. Uh, so let's just chuck a few more bits. Let's chuck them into Clive. And let's head off. He's now level 10. Look at him. He's like a race car. I just want to get to this city now. God only knows what that's going to look like. Okay, so... Here we are, we've reached the town at long last. It was actually a bit further than I thought. But, nonetheless, this is good. Because now we're here. It's going to give us an opportunity just to go and top up on a few things. It's a fairly simple looking city. Uh, I wonder if there's actually any NPCs here. Everything else is dead around here, so I don't even know if there's actually going to be people in there. I certainly wouldn't want to live here. How about you, Baz? Would you like to live here? Not really. No, Baz wouldn't like to live here either. I am Link. Hi yo, hi yo, hi yo. And uh, doesn't he look epic? This is a modded skin made by one of the guys on the Cube World forums. Uh, Tails is going to be my main character for my guide that I'm doing. Uh, he's only a very early prototype as well of Tails, so he he'll change as and when. We need him to be. So any comments on that will be will be greatly appreciated. Now I have been down into this dungeon. Uh, I haven't gone all the way down. I cleared the first few mobs. I don't do many dungeons with you guys, uh, especially on my own. Uh, so I thought it'd be quite nice if we could just complete this one. So we're going to head back down and uh, just see how far we can get in this dungeon as the epic link. I mean, that looks amazing. Ooh, silver. Okay, so we're going to head this way. Uh, I didn't go that way last time. Uh, I came up here, and then it was down here that the problems really started. There's a freaking genie down there. And an ancient guardian. So what I'm going to do... 
Oh, sugar, they've... They've already seen me. Now, because these guys are sort of uh, my level and my bow is so powerful, it does make my life a little bit easier because they're not quite tanking me as you might expect. Although the gin is still pretty powerful. Nonetheless, oh, what's that? It's a, uh, wow, a level 68 amulet. Tempo 7.8. It's the critical though, I love getting criticals. Uh, okay, so now that we've taken out those guys, we can probably take these out with relative ease. Uh, and also, whilst I'm in stealth, I can also do potions as well. It's actually a very, very handy thing. So let's see uh, how much damage we can cause down here. Okay. As you can see, I'm pretty powerful. Clive has aggroed this dude. And uh, it shouldn't be a problem. And then it's just the last two. Just to clear this room. So, like I say, the uh, the mobs in here are pretty much as they were before, which is a little bit disappointing. What's in here? Iron boots. Rubbish. What about you? Iron shoulder pads. Huh. Well, it would have been handy if I was a warrior. Uh, yep, pick that up. So much loot that has nothing to do with me. Okay, so uh, we're going to move through this. I, I mean, I don't know how quickly we're going to move through it. Uh, let's draw that dude there. But uh, thanks to thanks to just my strength, I mean, wow, wasn't expecting you to do that, you cheeky sod. Piss off. Oh wow, I didn't mean to draw them either. Okay, so it looks like we're doing most of this uh, this room straight off the bat. This uh, this this bow though makes such a difference with regards to how easy like mobs are when when they're your level, and as a result, anyone. Hiding behind there. No? Okay, well that room's fairly easy to clear. Oh, and we're moving down here. See what's in here. More copper. I've got so much money now. If I just press B to show you. I've got 279 platinum coins, 4 gold, 14 silver, and 37 copper. There's a, that's a lot. But at the moment, to be honest, even though I've got a lot of money, there's not actually a great deal to buy. So, it's a... Uh, it's, it's one of it's, it's a strange thing. It's... They need to they need to improve the uh, in-game economy, but yeah, alpha is alpha, so it, that'll change soon, no doubt. Oh, what did he drop? Is that a gold thing? No, it wasn't. It wasn't for me either. Uh, so right, so we've got a gin in here. We've got these dudes. Let's just take those and hope that we don't aggro anyone else. No, we won't. So we just take the mages out. Those boomerangs. Man, those boomerangs are powerful. Silver coin. Fair wood boomerang. No, it's nowhere near what this is. It's, 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 it's the only, that's the other little thing. is that Because I'm picking up loot that's so incredibly powerful. It's, uh, it's, it's difficult to go through and actually find anything of any use. I, I have been picking up armor bits, though, which is quite nice. But uh, I, 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 I'm surprised at how much I still enjoy this game. Wow, one shot at him with that. Mosquito, no problem. Jin, wow, you've thrown fireballs? What the hell, man? He was maged. Fortunately, I don't know if there's fewer mobs in here because I'm on my own or not, but there's a. Ooh, linen boots, a lot of gear there. Uh, and a wood bow. Any good? No, rubbish. I'm not even going to pick it up. My inventory gets so full otherwise. Uh, right, what have we got here? Can I just. Yeah, come on, just you guys. Don't come back here, Clive. How dare you attack Clive the Battle Sheep. How very dare... Oh, Clive's dinged as well. Level 11. I'd like some sort of indication that Clive has dinged. I think he deserves it. He works hard. Shabby wood crossbow. No good. Clean wood bow. That looks quite cool. I quite like the uh, the additional green leaves that have been made by the emeralds. I think that looks nice. Uh, right, so... Nope, we don't want to ride Clive. Off of Clive. Uh, what we want to do is go into stealth. I use this so much now, this mode, because, well, now that I've ranked it up, it's actually incredibly powerful, so it, 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 it makes life a lot easier. And and when I'm on my own, I don't really want to be trying to take on people from too far away. It, make, it doesn't really make any sense to do that. Oh, wow, you guys got utterly owned shit. I just think I just drew those. No. Uh, am I going to be able to... I'm going to have to try and take all of these out from here, I think. 
Moving on your own as a ranger in a dungeon is not nice. Oh, what have I done? Have I clipped into a wall again? God damn it. Okay, let's try that again. Yeah, moving on a ranger through, as a ranger through here is not very nice. There's a mage and there's two mages there. They're going to get it first. Mages are so dangerous. Wow, and that was a one shot. And he didn't fancy it, but he's going to get it anyway. Boom! And a ding as well to go with it. Nice. Oh, this, this character is so much fun now. Uh, I'm going to be playing some more multiplayer. I don't think that this is the end of the multiplayer. Uh, I was looking to get onto public servers and play with a lot of people, but to be honest, that's not a particularly viable thing at the moment. Mainly due to the fact that when you go into a multiplayer server, uh, everyone gets XP if a dungeon gets completed. And it doesn't matter. It doesn't even matter if the dungeon was miles away. You still get it. And I don't really. I'm not really keen on that. Oh no! I didn't. I wanted to take out the the boomerang dude. Wow! We've drawn the whole room. Not good. Evade. Evade. Pick up money. Evade. Boot. Wow. That kick has certainly come on leaps and bounds since the last time I uh, actually tried to use it. Oh, there's a slime there. I don't think I've got green though, which is a bit annoying. Christ, those boomerangs hit so hard. A slime. Uh, now, you, slime, are green, and I think I've only got blue. Blue pets. Yeah, I've only got blue. So, unfortunately for you, dude, it was a valiant effort, but uh, no. Sorry. Not this time. Get some health potions down there. I've, I haven't got many potions either, which is a bit of a fail, considering the boss is coming up. But uh, nonetheless, I'm just going to see how it goes. Is this the boss room? Oh, it is. And am I going to attract unwanted attention? Why did I go the other way? I should just come in here. Now that boss, Anion. Can I just? I just want to draw those. I don't want to draw the boss yet. Uh, but I have a horrible feeling. Ah, no, this is perfect. Good. Okay, we didn't draw the boss. Perfect. So we need to get into position. Get our stealth on. Unfortunately, Clive just got whooped. Let's just take these out. I'm not happy about the gin being there still. Because he's kicking my ass. Okay, splendid. Owned gin. Right, and now we can take on the boss. So... What I want to do is actually eat as opposed to. Let's do some strawberry mash. Don't know if this is going to fully recover me. Hi, Clive. Clive's back. So. Wow, that does 781 HP. That's nearly going to revive me. Okay, so that we're onto the boss. This shouldn't be too difficult. He's obviously got a massive amount of HP because he's a boss. Let's see. Wow, he's got a huge amount of HP, and he's a major. Freaking hate mages. Got to evade that. Got to evade that. Come on, Clive, don't get killed by him. Damn it. Ah, uh, sugar. Really don't want to be getting hit by that. That's better. Get him on the floor, and then get some specials on him. Then evade, 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 evade. Hopefully drag him up here a bit. I need to get away from that. Oh my god, that was not good. Strawberry mash, strawberry mash, come on. Clive, bother him for a bit. Unfortunately, Clive's going to take the brunt of this beating. Phew, it survived. Thank you, Clive. He did a good job. He's a brave lad. Man, that hit is hard. Not happy about that. Oh no, that didn't knock him over. That is not good. I need to recover that. Okay, Clive got owned again. He usually does that. Oh, I just about survived it. Oh, just knocked him over just before it had an effect. Okay, he's going down. He's going down. Yes! Get in there. That was one of the 
That was actually pretty. That wasn't. That was pretty comfortable. I got an ice spirit as well. Amazing. Clive. Oh, Clive dinged as well. Well, it looks a thing, so that's fine. Uh, Forty level forty-three, like a champion. Okay, so that was easy. Actually, I didn't mind that too much at all. Uh, we're going to increase that. I think. Amazing. Right. So we are now going to continue going through this place. I want to find a uh, a dungeon that is not a pyramid in here. So I'm going to go and look for a for another dungeon that's above ground and hopefully it's got some sort of different and new mobs in it, which I think will be amazing. But anyway, thank you for watching and I shall see you after I've found that, which won't be too long.